The reason why Clifton Elementary has chosen an innovation fair is because we have read and we hear so much in the media and from our experts that our scientific and technological advancements depend on how well we innovate, how well we think creatively, developing ideas that have relationships to things that may not be clearly obvious, the way that we take our scientific processes to a new level requires innovation. It's about inventing a product versus um, doing a scientific experiment, which is what science fairs are typically about, like researching and doing an experiment with chemicals and things. This is more like creating a product that you can actually sell. I think it helps them to focus on the process instead of just focusing on the, an invention because I think that, that this really focuses on getting kids to go through a process of innovating and research as opposed to just coming up, picking a great idea and saying, I'd like to make this. They really try and solve a problem. I certainly saw applications that there was a need for currently in the marketplace. Uh, there was one group who came up with a product called Freezy Easy that used fruits that were going bad to make smoothies. Um, and they had a, an apparatus that sat within a refrigeration device to accomplish that. And I just loved, not only was it reusing products and not throwing away things that we can still use, but it was a healthy bent to it. The workbook allows them space to record their interviews, make notes from brainstorming sessions, and sketch ideas or prototypes. I thought the workbook was actually kind of handy. There was actually lines for you to write in, and you could actually like say all your ideas, and it didn't matter which one you picked first. Mm -hmm. And then there was room to interview and everything, so I thought it was helpful. They're very helpful because they helped you brainstorm. Yeah, and, and they, they helped you easy to organize it so you can see it out. And, and they helped you put it. your ideas down on paper instead of just thinking of them. And they helped like guide you through the whole process. Oh, these workbook type things? Oh yeah, definitely, because when you work at the patent office, you see how people invent things, and then you, every now and then you get to see their uh, lab notebook, and you see what they're doing. They're thinking of ideas and solutions, so it's similar. The judges are very understanding. They ask great questions, and it builds wonderful communication skills confidence and enthusiasm about innovation. This process lends itself to more than just technological and scientific thinking. It applies to all areas of our life, the political process, everyday issues, business, the arts, conflict resolution. And it allows our children the opportunity to identify problems that are relevant in their world, to work together with others to collectively come up with creative solutions and to understand that in the process of working together as a team and to build on others' ideas, they can have a positive outcome.